Hello? Hi! Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. I got my notes. I got my notebook. I got everything. Okay, let's do it. I love that. Y'all seem pretty prepared tonight. I'm, I'm feeling this. You know, I was on... Hold on. Let me get my phone situated. Um... I was on Instagram, I was on TikTok, I mean, not TikTok, a Facebook. Facebook. And now I'm here. Now you're here, let's do it. Woo. So with Clarissa. Oh, if I can get my phone to sit back up. Uh-oh. There we go. There we go. So it's Clarissa. Yes. Clarissa Mack, how old are you? I'm 29. 29, what do you do for a living, boo? I'm an executive assistant at a nonprofit. Executive assistant. Do you have any children? I have one. He's 10. 10. Okay. Have you ever been married? Nope. Okay. What's your zodiac sign? I'm a cancer. July. And where are you calling me from? Cincinnati. Cincinnati. Uh -huh. Let's do it. We got Clarissa. She Ooh. is in Cincinnati, 29, a cancer, executive assistant, mom to a 10 year old, never married. What kind of man are you looking for, girl? Okay, I got my list. Um, my non-negotiable and qualities of my future king, someone that desires to be a man, um, is a good cook, home every night unless he's away from work, um, loving, catering, goes to church, has a hobby of some sort, um, single father of one or none, um, carries himself well and confident, has a uh stability in life not still trying to figure out what he wants to do has achievable goals and consistent with himself um masculine a leader not controlling um communication is big and must be top tier um i don't like anybody that can't communicate um someone i could be seeing in public with a family man family friend um yeah not too crazy Oh, okay. You said he wanted to be a cook too. Yes. No, not a cook. Knows how to cook. Knows how to cook. So yeah. you want him? You don't want to cook? I want to cook, but I don't want to cook every night. Okay. Knows how to cook. You didn't say provider. Uh, yeah. That's that's all the lines of within of being a provider. Yeah. So what does provider mean to you? Do you want him to pay all the bills? No. Um. I feel like I'm more realistic than most people that have been on the show. I can I can go um, go in on some bills. I don't mind being able to help. Out. Okay. Yeah. And you said you got to be able to be seen with him in per in public. Yeah, it's like the last. I just it's just guys they don't want to be seen in public. I don't know what it is. Oh, because you're not their girlfriend. So if a guy don't want to be seen with you in public. It's because he hasn't decided that you're his girlfriend, so he doesn't want people to associate you with you in that way. Yeah, I guess if that's how you want to put it. It's just I've had that issue. They don't want to be seen in public, and I'm just or, like. Or in another option could be he might already got a girl. Yeah, that too. I've had yeah. that. So yeah. So if you don't want to be seen, so ladies learn that if you don't want to be seen with you in public, he either got a girl or a wife or something. Or B, he hasn't decided that he wants to claim you yet, so he doesn't want to be in public with you yet. So, okay, yes. Okay, what are your deal breakers? I'm assuming you wrote it down. Yes, I got a list of deal breakers. Uh, military okay. men, men out of the U.S. Um, Wait, so I say it again. The phone went out. Say it one more time. Military men, I can't do. You're the second woman tonight that said no military men. Yeah, I dated a guy um, maybe two years ago. He was military, and I just uh uh I couldn't I can't do it again. Okay. Um, not willing to travel um, to me or just in general, not driven, no ambition. Party boy has to be out every weekend, working third shift. I to deal with that again. Doesn't communicate. Um, boring sex life, doesn't want kids, overweight and unkept. Ooh, child. <laughs> Not boring sex life. Okay. I'm going to be in one position all the time. <laughs> child. <laughs> the women are speaking out of 2024. She ain't no one position girl. Okay. Does he have to look a certain way? 
Um, I'm six one, so I would hope that he's at least five ten and taller. Um, he doesn't have to be the five ten walk on earth. I'm okay with the ugly guy. Um, yeah, just be kind. Okay. Nice to me. <laughs> that last word again. I said, just be kind and be nice to me. Be kind and be nice to her. What about money? Do we gotta make a certain amount of money? Um, I would say at least seventy and up. At least 70 and up. And you said he could have a child, but one. Yeah, one or none. One or none. All right, let's do the Kendra Cam, Clarissa. Oh, Lord. Okay. Just a second. Let me set my phone back up. All right. All right. Oh, you got a booty. We turn around when you see it. Ah, okay. Okay. So, Clarissa, 29. Um, executive assistant, mom to a 10 year old, um, also a cancer is for zodiac sign. When was yes. your last relationship? Um, December. Last month. Yes, last month. Okay. You don't with... have to answer, but I'm gonna ask him the last time he was in uh January 1st. Don't know why. He still hasn't explained it to me to this day. Um, but yeah, January 1st, he broke up with me. He broke so you, you guys were in a relationship. And the first day of the year, he broke up with you? Yeah. He didn't, he didn't give you the reason why? Um, I feel like it was more so of stuff that he needed to work on himself. Um, we did the off and on again for three years. And it's just, I'm at the point, I want to be married. I want a husband. Um, and I don't think he was prepared for that, in all honesty. Okay. So you guys haven't talked since then? Haven't talked since then. Okay, so you're newly single. Yeah, newly single. Okay, newly single. Okay, did he have children? He had one. He had one, okay. Um, all right, so what are three flaws you have to work on, Clarissa? Oh, my three flaws. Um, I could be impatient sometimes. Um, I want what I want when I want it, and if I don't get it, I do have an attitude about it. Um, I'm clingy. Um, I can self-isolate sometimes. Like, to the point, I just want to be by myself and with my child. Um, that's just me. Um, I move too fast. I'm a little picky. And um, I'm too caring at times. You're too caring at times. Okay. And um, why would a guy be lucky to be with you? Oh, I got a list for that, too. <laughs> um, he'll be lucky to be with me because I'm loving. Um, I love heart. I'm nurturing. Um, I don't entertain a whole bunch of people. Um, I'm a homebody. I love to cook. I make my own coins. I'm stable. I have everything of my own. Um, I'm spiritual, but not religious. Um, I'm a good mom. I'm a family girl. I'm fun and outgoing. I get along with most people and I communicate. And she communicates. And you said you, your goal is marriage, correct? My goal is marriage. What qualities make you a wife? Um, everything I just said, um, that why they're lucky to date me. Ooh, and there you have it. Rewind <laughs> the tape if you wasn't listening close enough, fellas. All right. So oh, what's the age range you would date? Okay. My age range is I'm 29. I'll be 30 in July. Um, I would say 35 and up to about 40, 45. Okay. And should he be in Cincinnati? Um, no, I'd be open to Cincinnati, um, but he doesn't have to be here. Okay. All right, so we got Clarissa, 29, executive assistant um, to a nonprofit, correct? Mm-hmm. Has a mom to a 10-year-old, cancer, lives in Cincinnati. Fellas between the age of 35, 45, she has a very um, detailed list of her requirements. <laughs> Rewind the tape to make sure you fit all the categories before you reach out to her. How can the man reach out to you, honey? Um, you can reach me on my Instagram at Braxton's mom or my TikTok, Braxton's underscore mom. I'm happy to talk to you. I think I saw you on Instagram. Yes. Yes. You said my name Braxton's and I was like, oh, going to pick me. And then sure enough, I, didn't I know I couldn't find you when I was trying to, I saw it that I was going to pick you and then I couldn't find you in the list. 
So I'm happy it worked out. You made it to YouTube. And I'm typically in bed by like 8.30, 9 o'clock. So it's like, this is very rare for me to be up this late. <laughs> what time is it in Cincinnati? It's 11.05 right now. Woo, child. So that's East Coast time, 8, 9, yeah. 10, 11. Yes, 8 o'clock. I live in Beverly Hills. So it's 8 o'clock here. Yeah. So okay, okay. Well, listen, well, I'm happy you stayed up. Let's see if you stayed up. And let's see if your man is watching, girl. I hope so. I hope so, too. I'm ready for you. <laughs> Kitty, post how it goes, honey. All right, I will. Bye. Bye, baby.